good to see you again. Um, so how are you guys doing? Um, I don't know what happened with me, but I've been obsessed with lipsticks these days. And I actually, for the past three weeks, I've been hauling quite a few lipstick. Um, yeah, that surprised me as well. But I'm really addicted to these summer collections because I really like the sheer finish. And um, I think they have brilliant colors as well, so that's why I got addicted. Um, yeah, let's go through each one. I mean, I'm excited to show you what I've got. Well, since the lighting is not so good and I'm not going to show any swatches in this video, I'm going to show you the products, but the swatches will be on my blog in a few days. So if you're interested in taking a look at how the color looks like, I would suggest that you go to my blog. And also there would be reviews on there as well because I've been trying these products for days. So uh, I think it's a good time to review. Um, anyway, um, let's start with the first brand, it's SK2. Interesting, right? Um, recently they have launched their cosmetic line and I happen to get really interested in the lipstick because um, it reminds me of the old times. Yeah, the packaging looks like this. It's kind of like a bullet. What? Like this. It reminds me of the old time lip balm, lip color thingy because of the center part. Um, I remember the old time they called the center part like the lip moisturizer and then the outer part is kind of like the color. Um, this one is actually <laughs> the middle part is um, Pitera. If I remember right, I have to check though. Uh, but I recall it's something related to like kind of a moisturizing ingredient. And then the outer part is the color. Um, this one is number 441. And um, this is quite a bronzy color. I haven't tried this one yet. I've been trying the, the other one. And um, yeah, quite interesting to try this one on the lips. And the other color is more um, a little bit more natural, it's like this, kind of like a coral with a hint of pink in it, and again the center part is um, where the gimmicks come from. And um, this number is number 321. Yeah, so I got a couple from SK2 and um, got a little bit excited like. And the second brand I got is Lancome. Yeah, it's the um, famous Fruits in Love. Um, they've launched this recently and I think they got like um, 20 something colors to choose from but I happened to pick four. Um, yeah, I know I'm bit obsessive but it's kind of interesting I mean some of the colors are quite vibrant and some of the colors are quite um, uh, natural and they divide the collection into three categories one uh, one is morning time and then the other one is like kind of like noon time and then the other one is kind of like you know night time when you go out and party and I really like the packaging as well it's very chic and the back has like a red line, dotted line, kind of interesting. And this color is number 230M. And the color looks like this. And the name is Jolie Madame. It's French, happy morning or something. Uh, <laughs> yeah, I know, I, I'm not really good with French, um, even though I studied it for a while. I, I um, kind of like this collection a lot because when you put it onto your skin, almost a sheer finish, see? It has a glossiness to it, and that's what I like. I mean, um, in the summertime, I like the lipstick to be a little bit like shiny and also not heavily matte. I like that sheer finish and I think it suits um, summer really well. 
And the second color I got is uh, 132M. Yeah, 132M. And the color is like this. Yeah, I really like this one. As you can see, I've been using um, quite a bit actually. And actually, I have it on my lips right now. Again, the lighting is not so good. Um, but the name is Cora in Love. And it matches my, almost matches my. Yeah, when you look it at in real time, it almost matches my um, nails. But here on the camera, I notice it shows up a bit pink. So that's why you have to see the swatches on my blog. Yeah, I really like it, this one because it's very, very, very summer. And the other one is number 167N. I think I got this one because I was reading someone from Twitter that they said it's the perfect red. And I was like, oh, I have to get this. Yeah, it's a nice red, and I think it looks a bit bright here, but when you use it on your skin, this is the red. Again, it has that sheer finish and glossiness to it. It's really amazing. It's really amazing. And the reason why I like this summer collection, right, is because they almost feel like a tinted lip balm. It has a nice amount of color, but still feels like lip balm, actually. And it's quite moisturizing. I've been loving these. Um, <laughs> the last one from the collection that I got. Um, 247B. 247B. And I would say this is more like a nude color for tan skin. Um, not too nude. Um, it carries a little bit of a brown tone to it. Yeah, it's almost almost like a skin color. Yeah, I think this is like quite cool. I haven't tried them all um, in one go, but I've been trying like um, the coral color and then um, the red color from time to time, and I really like it. And the last lipstick I got is from Sogo Stay for a week. Um, and I'm amazed. I mean, this is the only thing I got from a sale at Soko. So I was like, I am so good. Um, anyway, this one is 10% um, off. And I was like, okay, let's get this. as from NSV. I'm not sure if this is a new collection. I don't think it is. Um, but I kind of like the texture and the color. This one is number 301. E. Yes, 301. Um, it's called Le Push G. Don't know what the G means. Um, and again, with NSV products, it's always very, very fantastic, I would say. And you can look at the whole packaging thing. It stands out, right? And there is the, the NSV at the top. Isn't that nice? I can guarantee you it doesn't look that pink on your lips. <laughs> so if you really like that pink on your lips, uh, don't buy it because it, again, it's sheer finish. Um, it's really moisturizing and it's really, really nice. It's like a light pink. I mean, if you really um, like have very fair skin, um, this would make you look really healthy. Like almost your lips is naturally pink and I like that. This is really cool. And what's interesting with NS3 products is that they got a scent to it. Um, the lipstick has a really nice scent to it and the nail polish has a really nice scent to it as well. Apart from lipsticks, I actually haul mm, two pair of shoes from Vivian Westwood. Um, yeah, I've been their fan for quite some time and I particularly like their accessories and also some of their bags. And now it comes to shoes. 
Yeah, I got this pair and it looks really practical and it looks really elegant on the feet actually because of this design. Um, I particularly like this frame um, design because it's really eye-catching when it's on your feet. And also, you can see this is an open toe actually. But no worries because if you don't have the nicest um, toes on earth like I do, <laughs> um, this won't show up too much actually, so no worries. And most of the people don't even notice it. And this pair of shoes have like black and I would call this a beige color. And um, I picked this because it kind of goes with my style these days, you know, a brown, tan, nude color. So I thought I'd pick this one. And the material is actually plastic. Um, I'm not sure if they have a formal name, but I would call it plastic. Um, and it's water resistant, so it's perfect for rainy days. And they also got a Vivian Westwood logo here, so it's really, really cool. And um, I've been loving this one. Um, and I think it's kind of fun. Um, to have a pair like this. I mean, it looks good even is um, you know, flats and many of the people don't think flats look good but I think some of them can look really nice. And <laughs> the other pair is really really fun because it's sandals and it looks like this. Yay! This one, it looks a bit funky, but I kind of like it that way. And they have many colors to choose from, from what I remember from uh, beige, black, silver, gold, and red. Um, and some other colors that I don't remember. Um, but I picked red because um, kind of like this. I mean, it's kind of like sharp. And the interesting design is, there is a strap here. And then here is the thing. <laughs> there is the logo. And if I can use my hand to pretend my foot, let's see if I get the effect. So basically, your feet looks like this um, on the shoes. And I've tried this um, walking around the house because I haven't been trying it out yet. And it feels very comfortable and it feels very very cool because um, you know your feet are actually bare <laughs> almost bare and they actually look good I mean if you have mm, nail polish on your toes it would look really really nice with this pair and therefore I got this cool um, I hope you enjoyed this haul and um, as usual I am going to say I'm not gonna haul anymore but somehow I cannot resist it so I'm not saying that anymore um, I'm just go with the flow <laughs> and um, so if you have Facebook or Twitter um, you can follow me and Instagram as well and um, there will be more frequent updates um, if you're interested and um, see you guys very soon bye